local in Arkansas. A heartbreaking story really coming out of Forest City. A story that will break your heart and make mm -hmm. you kind of mad too. St. Francis County investigators are looking for the crook who stole hunting gear specially built for an eight-year-old disabled boy. Local 24's Tish Clark is live in the studio tonight. Tish, you talked to Jace is his name. Yes, I did. Richard and Katina, what an incredible kid with an amazing spirit. Now, Jace is one of those kids who, well, he loves to be outside. He loves to hunt and fish. Jace's grandfather built him a wheelchair, accessible deer stand with specially designed hunting equipment. But you know what? All of it was stolen Friday while Jace was at rehab. When we went to the children's hospital, my mom told me, and I was super disappointed. Eight-year-old Jace Collins is in a wheelchair after he was paralyzed in a car wreck in 2015. His bright red hair and beaming smile will light up a room, and his heartbreaking story will pull at your heartstrings. Somebody had broken into his deer stand and took everything out of it. A few months after Jace's accident, he killed his first deer, a seven-point buck, thanks to the hunting equipment his grandfather built for him. It's from the heart. You know, he needed it. I did it. Jace's granddad, Glenn Shepard, built him a wheelchair accessible heated deer stand complete with a dead mount stand which allows Jace to prop up his gun, aim and shoot since he has limited mobility. You really don't understand it but this is stress on him, you know, to, to lose his function of his legs and have wheels. Jace tries to have a positive attitude but deep down he's heartbroken. He just wants to do what he loves. I'm not sure how, am I, how I'm going to do it because I don't have that dead shot. He's going to get to go hunting. He's going to get to go fishing. He might not do it the same way the other kids do, but he'll get the joy and the satisfaction. All right, heartbreaking, but yet yeah, so sweet. That little boy is so sweet. Now, people have stepped up to help. He and his family say they are grateful for the outpouring of love and support. If you have any information about Jace's stolen gear, please call the St. Francis County Sheriff's Department. Live in the studio tonight, Tish Clark, Local 24 News.